opened out in Slovakia. I played in Israel. I played in Italy twice. I played in Turkey, and now I'm back in Italy with Trento. It's, uh, it's definitely been like a steady climb. I've been improving year by year, like as a personal level, like with stats and numbers, and I've been improving like my leagues. I'm definitely a high energy guy. I play the game with a lot of passion, a lot of emotion, and I play hard and compete and try to win every single night. I'm gonna do all the little things that help keep the team like driving and like going towards a common goal and that's to try to win basketball games and to have fun while we do it. Me as a student, I was always the one that made the class have fun. I like to joke around and just be a class clown, but I also was very focused on doing my work. So I definitely had a great like balance. My best game of my career, I would probably say I was in Mantua and we were down two, two to one in the finals. And we had to go on the road and play at Castle Pustalengo. And we went to overtime and I made some great plays in the closing seconds of the game to give us the win. The worst moment of my career was maybe my senior year of college, like almost that whole year. I didn't get the chance to play like a whole lot and I didn't, it kind of made me second guess myself as a basketball player. When I was 12, I lost a brother. He got killed in a train accident and a train hit the car he was traveling in with uh, our sister's fiance at the time. And uh, he was 11 and I was 12, so that definitely changed my life and made me look at things from a totally different perspective. My tattoos, they definitely mean a lot to me. I think each of them tell a story about a certain part of my life. I have 19, and the one that I think, well, I have two that mean a whole lot to me. This one is my mother's name, because if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be who I am. And this one is of uh, my brother, my very first tattoo, and it was in memory of him. Playing in Turkey, it was a great place to play basketball at a very high level because they have so many ex-NBA players and it's some of the best teams in EuroLeague are there. But like just everyday life in Turkey can get stressful at times because of all the things going on politically and uh, the bombings and everything that's happening. So it's hard to focus solely on basketball. The tournament was an amazing experience. It's, it definitely gave you the opportunity to play at a high level during the summertime, which most people don't get a chance to. And it was also very nerve wracking because one loss and you lose out on $1 million the previous year and $2 million this past year. But it was definitely a great experience and we, luck was on our side and we won both years. The first year I won 100000 and I used that money, the majority of it, to buy my mom a new car. And the second year I won 175000 and I'm purchasing a home very soon in Atlanta, Georgia.